Salutations, YouTube. Welcome to Review Friday. So, we have her Owl Crate for you. It is the November box, which is the Wonderland theme. So, let's see what's inside. So, as always, we first have our card. And here's our back. And here is our pin to match it. So, first, Wonderland, spoiler warning. Take a seat at the Mad Hatter's Tea Party with this delicious tea blend created by Riddle's Tea Shop and Adego. This tea was designed exclusively for Owl Crate, and we hope it brings you joy at many happy and birthday parties. So, I actually don't drink a lot of tea, but I do want to try and explore it a little bit more. Um, this It's funny that it says happy unbirthday parties, because my birthday is tomorrow, so yay me. Um... <laughs> So here we have our little box. It's very cute. Um, let's rip this off. So here's a better look at it, and here's our sides. Got a little caterpillar there. And on the back, it's got our ingredients. I feel like it's gonna taste really good because it smells really good. And I can even keep this box for little trinkets afterwards, so that's very cute. So here's our inside. <laughs> this is so cute. Curiouser and curiouser. I freaking love the cat so much. I love cats in general, but chess is the best. So I didn't know if it was loose tea or bags, but it's, I mean, loose tea in bags. So it's bagged tea. So here's what it looks like, and there's a bunch of them, and they actually smell so good. I will definitely be trying these, and then I'll give a review on them to let you know if it's a good, a good shop, and we'll look into what their shop's all about and kind of what else they have. So. Are you curious enough to stumble upon the rabbit hole? This stunning bookmark created exclusively by author adornments will help you find your way to Wonderland in no time. Each bookmark was made by hand with lots of love. So we've got it in this baggie. This is author adornments. So in my other video, we had a bookmark from My Heart, My Tribe. And I've recently lost the bookmark that I've been using. I don't know where it went. I feel like it's underneath my bed somewhere because... I was reading and I think I forgot to move it, so when I went to bed, it just disappeared. Um, so I've been using the bookmark from My Heart, My Tribe, and I only just started using it the other day, and I already feel like it's probably not going to work because I feel like it's just giving the pages a little bit of crinkle, which is what I was afraid was going to happen. Um, so maybe I just watch the pressure that gets put on the books with those types of bookmarks. And same with this type, it's even worse than that one. But it's very pretty, and I'd even use it as like an accessory. So here is what our bookmark looks like. Super pretty. And it has a little bit of an, from Alice in Wonderland, a little bit of the page inside. Curiouser and curiouser, it says. And here's Author Dorman's bookmark, or business card, sorry. The talented Evie Bookish has designed an exclusive magnet just for you. Place it on your fridge or locker for a daily reminder to always use your imagination. Imagination is the only weapon in the war against reality. So here's our, our magnet. I have a whiteboard in my room, so I will definitely be putting that on it. We're thrilled to have been able to partner up with our fantastic people at Rock Paper Books again. Read the original story of Alice, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland with this beautiful exclusive paperback edition and a matching bookmark designed by the ma amazing artist Risa Rudel. I don't know if I pronounced that right. So here's our little bookmark. Very cute, very girly looking. And the book to match. She generally gave herself very good advice, though she very seldom followed it. Very... She generally gave herself very good advice, though she very seldom followed it. I feel like this is a very known Alice in Wonderland quote. 
Okay, so I've just seen what our book is, and I'm so excited. The all-known story of the ruthless queen of hearts. But has anyone stopped to wonder how she grew to be so evil? Catherine is a girl of simple dreams. She aches to use her talents to start her own bakery with the best with her best friend, and to live a simple life in Wonderland. Her parents, as well as the king of Wonderland, have very different plans for her. But when she meets the handsome court joker, Jest, at a royal ball, Kath's life takes a very unexpected and romantic turn. In a world filled with magic and madness, will Kath be able to live the life she dreams of? We are, we are over the moon to be able to send out this exclusive edition of Heartless by the br brilliant Marissa Meyer. You can't find this cover anywhere else. We also hope you love the letter from Marissa and the adorable quote card. Happy reading, and thanks for being awesome. I'll create. So, I have this, I've had this book on my wish list before it even came out. And I put it on my Christmas list, so now I'm going to have to take that off because I own it, and I'm so excited. And here's our cover. So, I feel like it looks like the one that is, like, in stores, except the one that's in stores is black and red, whereas this one's wet, whereas this one's white, black, and red, with, like, a little bit of red. So, I'm going to try and put a little image here to kind of compare the two and see what they look like side by side. So let's open it up. So first off when you feel it, all of the lettering is nice and soft, like nice and smooth and um, has that like bumpy texture to it and it feels really nice. And then the paper is kind of like that hard drawing, like that thick drawing paper. That's what it feels like to me and I really like that a lot. And here we have on the back her other, her other books, her other series. So I own Cinder, um, but I don't have any the other the next two because um, stores don't have them in hardcover anymore. So I need to buy them online somewhere. Um, I think I have Winter and I have Stars Above because it was on sale one time and I was like, oh well, I know I'm gonna get it eventually, so I might as well get it once on sale. And I don't have the other one yet, the last one. So, yay, I'm so excited. It's so pretty. So here's a little quote card. Sometimes your heart is the only thing worth listening to. And here's our letter. Dear Alcrate Reader, Despite the title, Heartless has been a work of my heart. It combines two great loves, Lewis Carroll's Alice in Wonderland and a fascina fascination for villain origin stories. After all, I've long to believe there was more to the decapitation, happy queen of hearts. Why is she always so angry, so bloodthirsty? Well, a few years ago, my imagination began to concoct a story, not of Tranquil Ma Mallor, but of a teen girl who yearned for more than society had planned for her. As you read Heartless, I hope you'll laugh, fall in love, and be played by the insistent sweet tooth. But mostly, I hope you'll enjoy this trip down the rabbit hole. Best regards, Marissa Meyer. So, for next month, we have the theme of the December box is epic. In the December box, you'll receive an item from Dark Horse. So I've already seen some things online, mainly from Al Crate's Instagram, um, that has said um, kind of what's going to be in the next box. They said there's going to be something from Harry Potter, um, Lord of the Rings, Game of Thrones, so that's something interesting to look forward to. So there you have it. Thanks so much for coming down the rabbit hole with me today. I hope you really enjoyed this Al Crate unboxing. Um, so if you want to go and throw a like and a comment, let me know that you enjoyed this. And a subscribe also so you get updated on when I post my content. So yeah, um, my Instagram and my Twitter are down below. And I also have some links for the content that was in this box as well as any music that I use at the end on my end card. So yeah. Uh, thanks again for watching. Signing off.